Good evening and welcome to Compton on Tuesday evening. As we watch Teddy Bear relaxing, let's just have a moment of relaxing back into God so we can kind of put the world aside just for a short while. I will lie down and sleep in peace for you alone, Lord. Make me dwell in safety. O God and Spirit, in Jesus you the three, from the crown of my head, O Trinity, to the soles of my feet, mine offering be. Come I unto thee, O Jesus you my King, O Jesus you do thou be my sheltering. My dear ones, O God, bless thou and keep in every place where they are. Whoever has chosen to make the shelter of the Most High their dwelling place will stay in his overshadowing. He alone is my refuge, my place of safety. He alone, he, sorry, he is my God and I am trusting him. He will rescue you from the traps laid for your feet and save you from the destroying curse. His faithful promises are your armour. You need no longer be afraid of any terror by night or the death arrow that flies by day. The Lord himself is your refuge. You have made the Most High your stronghold. Be my rock, a castle to keep me safe. For you are my crag and my stronghold. How precious to me your thoughts, O God. How vast is the sum of them. Right to count them, though that number the grains of sand. When I awake, I am still with you. I will not lie down tonight with sin, nor shall sin, nor sin shadow, lie down with me. O God of life, this night, O darken not to me thy light. O God of life, this night, close not thy gladness to my sight. O God of life, this night, thy door to me, O shut not tight. O God of life, this night. You know, words from Jesus calling says this to us. Thank me throughout each day for my presence and for my peace. These are gifts of supernatural proportions. Ever since the resurrection, I have comforted my followers with these messages. Peace be with you and I am with you always. Listen as I offer you my peace and presence in full measure. The best way to receive these glorious gifts is to thank me for them. It is impossible to spend too much time thanking and praising me. I created you first and foremost to glorify me. Thanksgiving and praise put you in a proper relationship with me, opening the way for my riches to flow through you. As you thank me for my presence and peace, <coughs> you appropriate my richest gifts. And as we move into a time of prayer, a time of quiet, let me pray. Heavenly Father, help us to say thank you in all circumstances. Not to say thank you that our circumstances are hard, but to say thank you that in those circumstances, you are with us, guiding us, offering us peace, and you will always be there. Amen.
Let's say the Lord's Prayer together. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Be it on thine own beloved arm, O God of grace, that I in peace shall waken. Jesus, son of Mary, my helper, my encircler. Jesus, son of David, my strength everlasting. Jesus, son of Mary, my helper, my encircler. The peace of all peace be mine this night, in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless you for joining me this evening for Compline. Remember to take care of yourself and those around you and pray for yourself and those around you. And let's continue to pray for our troubled world, the Middle East, the Ukraine, and all those places that deserve peace, but are struggling with a war that is not their own. Amen. <laughs>